Greetings, library lovers. This is Wendy McVicker, Athens Poet Laureate, bringing you a poem by Naomi Shihab Nye. I want to thank the Athens County Public Libraries and particularly Becca Lachman for inviting me to share poetry with you during this National Poetry Month when we are all sheltering in place. This poem is called Cross That Line. Of course, we don't want to be crossing social distancing lines, but she's not talking about that line. Cross that line. Paul Robeson stood on the northern border of the USA and sang into Canada, where a vast audience sat on folding chairs waiting to hear him. He sang into Canada his voice left the USA when his body was not allowed to cross that line. Remind us again, brave friend, what countries may we sing into? What lines should we all be crossing? What songs travel toward us from far away to deepen our day? So I guess I want to remind you that even when your body is not allowed to go out and meet another, your voice can still meet someone, even someone who is very, very far away, or someone who is nearer, who seems very, very far away. So I would encourage you to reach out with your voice to another today. Naomi Shihab Nye, who is, among other things, the Young People's Poet Laureate, named by the Poetry Foundation, um, said, and this seems appropriate to us in our time right now, I have always loved the gaps, the spaces between things, as much as the things. I love staring, pondering, mulling, puttering. I love the times when someone or something is late. There's that rich possibility of noticing more in the meantime. Poetry calls, calls us to pause. There is so much we overlook while the abundance around us continues to shimmer on its own. So pause, notice, make notes, Share your notes to share with the library at some point and reach out with your voice to another. Thank you. This has been Wendy McVicker, Athens Poet Laureate, with a poem by Naomi Shihab Nye.